I was asked to give some advice about the YouTube lifestyle and how to create a channel and all that. Um, I was very hesitant in wanting to do this because people like to blame people for things that go wrong. So when you give out advice, they say, I did what you did, nothing happened, and you're a piece of shit. No, it, it, this is why I, I don't like to do this advice stuff. But I'm going to give you maybe a tip or two that kind of helped me grow a little bit. Because I did see some surges and it just stabilized and surges and stabilized. It does that. My subscriber count is insane. Very rarely is it just gradually going up like normal normal channels would do. I have surges and I get nobody for years and I get massive surges and nobody for years. That's kind of how this YouTube channel works. It's very embarrassing and the metrics are all over the place, but the views are doing okay. So I'm okay with it. Uh, I just don't have people wanting to uh, follow me. Again, they just want to do a one-stop shop and see me say, hey, cool, I love the entertainment, and they fuck off. And I don't see him again, because they didn't even press subscribe. So, it is what it is. Uh, but here's, here's a tip. Um, try your very hardest. I know it's difficult to do, but try your hardest to be yourself. No one can replicate you, and they can try and impersonate you, but they can't 100% be you. They might be able to be you 80%, 90%, but not 100. There's a good advice right there. I want to do two tips. I was one number one. Tip number two. Uh, make sure your lighting is somewhat adequate. I use this little desk lamp. Not very big. I don't use a fuck off massive sunlight where I'm just going to light the sky up and just light everyone else up around me. Uh, I don't use that, I just use a little dinky portable light that I got for like 99 pence, 99 cents. Cheap. But it kind of works, you know? Goes in the face, lights it up, makes it look nice. Yeah, I wish it was a little bit closer, but, you know, lighting is very important. Obviously my lighting should be improved. Yeah, that's something I'm not doing the best. Alright, so that's something for you guys uh, that I'm fucking up on myself, is lighting. Uh, YouTubers have the best lighting. The big YouTubers, the best YouTubers, best streamers. Lighting is important. My lighting is adequate. It's fucking average. But it needs to be improved. But, but there's there's something. There you go. Always learn from my failures. It's a lot easier to learn from someone else's failures than it is to learn from your own failures. It's a lot cheaper and a lot less time consuming. Learning from someone else's failures. Eye contact. That was my third point, and someone probably picked up on it already. Look at the camera. If you're looking at multiple directions all over the place, looking like a crackhead like this, you're going to look crazy, okay? Look at the camera. I know it's a little round circle. It's got a lens on it. Uh, it's a little shiny sometimes. That's going to help you have build trust with the audience because they would like for you to look at the camera you know, not, not glare at the camera, like stare at it or stare you down, but, you know, just glancing, looking, more looking at the camera and then occasionally look away, but mainly looking at the camera, you know, it builds confidence and trust. All right, I'll talk to you guys later, talk to your girls later, you know, since we have guys and girls on here for my analytics, which is cool, uh, different age brackets too, from anywhere from like teenagers to freaking retired people, so that's cool, it's cool to see.